how different it is to the UK. Because normally you'd either go to uni and learn about it there or you'd go to work. It wouldn't ever be combined. Like how Grand Canaries is and how their festivals are different to everywhere else. Okay. Excellent. <laughs> Ah, the boat day was fun, wasn't it? Nice blue, clear water, which you don't get in Britain. I've never jumped in the sea before, and I actually jumped in the sea, and I did panic when I was under the water, so that was actually amazing, to be fair. That was one of my biggest fears that I've overcome, so... I look at you, look at me like you want to go. Yeah, the, boat, the best thing was when me and Abby went for a nice little swim. I think the best bit of the boat day was jumping in the water, I think. Water was a lot, sort of, warmer, so it was nicer. Oh my God, I jumped off the boat. Jumping off the boat was amazing. Six hours where everyone's together on that boat and there's no escape. So we were kind of there expecting maybe for the, some of them just to want to get off really quickly or want to get away, but they all just absolutely smashed it that day. <laughs> just really embraced that day, it was really good. Oh, the horse riding school was really good actually. Oh, I love the donkey. So when we were painting and we just, me and Johnny just focused on painting and just didn't listen to what anyone else had to say and just painted like they told us to do and just got on with it. It made me feel really good because obviously it was an abandoned place before and we've made it so like more, they can like rescue more horses. It's not, painting is not really hard for me because I know how to paint already but it was, it was a good activity. Good work experience just to see what it was like working at like a farm, painting and stuff. Yeah, it was an abandoned barn so we helped paint and make it look beautiful. And it was actually pretty good. I like cracking on with it because it was getting the job done and ended up making it a lot better than what it was. It was a really good experience and we got to ride, ride the horses which is actually epic, so yeah. It was, a, it, it was good, it was, but the only annoying thing was is that you just get sand in your shoes. <laughs> as soon as we arrived, there was half the learners that just wanted to go and run bare feet on the sand or with socks on so they didn't burn their feet. But wanted to just go and run on the dunes, which is really nice because it's a natural reserve, so it's something that we don't have back home. <laughs> it's something that you wouldn't see, like, it's like something you would see in a dream or something. The sand dunes yeah. were amazing. Like I've been a lot of places in the world, but I've never seen sand dunes like that. Like it was beautiful. It, it was a nice place to see because you don't have that in Britain. The holiday world was like we really, really had a good laugh. Didn't yeah, we? it was a good world. laugh. I went on multiple rides of the same thing. Uh, I enjoyed the one that did a 180 turn all the way up in the cage. <laughs> I actually got singing, I never sing in front of people unless I'm in the shower on my own, so that was really, really good. It was interesting to see the ones that wouldn't normally come forward and um, who felt comfortable in that environment to, to come forward and have a, little, have a little sing and a dance. And I think because the learners got to see the adults let their guard down, um, that they felt a little bit more comfortable in themselves. It was a bit different, but it was really cool to stand up on yeah. the tour. I will 100% be cooking my mum one of those dishes. Yes, we love Letty! <laughs>